Okay, we are going to get into a game with you before we let you go. It's super, it's rapid fire. It's just like all easy, fun questions about you. Um, And yeah, you ready? I guess. Let's do it. Okay. (laughs) What is your go-to breakfast? Go-to breakfast is probably an acai bowl. I love them. I like make one every morning. You make it at home? Yeah, I do. I used to buy them, but they're like twenty dollars each. So I was like, "This is not fiscally responsible." That's so true. I just get the little packets at Whole Foods and, like, you know, like put the granola and some fruit. Oh they're my great. gosh, so yeah. cute! What is your favorite color to wear? Uh, green. Which I mean, perfect. Do you have green eyes? <laughs> they're like green blue. I don't yeah. know. They change. They kind of change with my emotions sometimes. People would say that. Like if I cry, they get more green, and then if I'm That's angry, so I guess interesting. Blue. Oh my gosh. <laughs> It's like a Disney character. <laughs> yeah. What's your favorite season? My favorite season, I mean, typical answer, but fall. I love the fall and everything that comes with it. Halloween's my favorite holiday. Halloween's your favorite holiday? I love Halloween. I know that That's that so is rare. controversial. It is rare. I, I just, I love like spooky things. And I, I know it's like leading up to Thanksgiving I don't know. Yeah. I love Halloween. No, I love Everyone, that. Is that weird? Probably. No, it's no, not weird love, at all. I, mean, I just feel Hall- like. I mean, I, we love Halloween. Yeah. yeah. We just don't like dressing. I just don't like dressing up, but I love the idea. You love I spooky love, season. Like, yeah. I love the. Like we'll get like fall spooky candles season. and yeah. like. Yeah. Like passing things. out candy. Like, you know, Christmas is on its way. Yeah. yeah. It's a good time. What is a big green flag for you? Good relationship with their family. What's a relationship deal breaker for you? A relationship deal breaker would be someone who cheats uh, for sure or someone who's not driven in their career or I shouldn't even say their career, but like not passionate about what they're doing in their life. What's your dream vacation destination? I want to go to Japan so badly. We are saying maybe this we might go. Joe's been. I've been. It's amazing. Is it amazing? We, we, yeah. We, we want to try to go this year. Probably, probably near. You guys have to. Maybe End September of year. ish. Yeah. We'll see. We'll see if we it happens. I'm hoping it does. Yeah, cross my fingers. What's one thing on your bucket list? I think on the bucket list would be I I really want to run like a marathon or a triathlon just because when I was originally diagnosed with like all my health stuff, they were like, You probably won't be able to do like extreme sports or anything that's really hard on your body anymore, which like growing up playing sports that was devastating for me to hear. And I kind of want to prove my doctors wrong and be like, even though I like, cause it's a long time and hard on your body. So they're worried it might like exasperate my symptoms or make me feel like a lot worse with my back. So I kind of want to like run one and then give my doctor like my like bib to put in their office. Yeah, nice. you should do it. What oh, city? Yeah. If you, if you could run it anywhere, where would you want to run? It? Uh, probably New York. Joe yeah. did the New York marathon this past nice. year. Nice. Yeah. It was, it's, they say it's, they, it's intense. I don't know, but they say New York's one of the harder courses. Oh, yeah. Um, but yeah, it was a very re- rewarding. I did on the, right under four hours. So I was three, okay, nice. 358, 358. Yeah. And uh, I did not run it. I, I was going to say, did you run <laughs> No. Did you I hold one of the signs? I did. I had a sign yeah. that said, run, Joe, run. I love it. Um, what is, or do you have any tattoos? I do not, um, but I'm not opposed to them. I just haven't found the right thing. Yeah. What's your favorite physical quality of Joey's? Physical quality, his eyes. I I feel like everyone probably says that, but not even just the color, like they're very kind. Yeah. What is your, or who is your go-to when you need advice? My best friend, Megan. We, she's my first friend I made when I moved to the United States and she's more like a sister. What yeah. is your favorite beauty product at the moment? These are all my uh, questions. I know. <laughs> I'm like, yeah. so I'm struggling to read them. I'm like, wait, what does this say? Oh, I know the answer to this one. The Elf lip oil, because on the show, all the girls use the Dior one, but it's so expensive and I just can't justify that. So yeah. the, Elf, the Elf one's like $9 and it's amazing. Oh my yeah. God. That's a good dude. Not to do a, not to do a product placement. No, let me see. I, I love well, my That's why Elf, Elf is blown up because of this. Yeah. You yeah. Because of the oil. Good job, Joe. <laughs> I, I, we were just it. talking about Elf the this. other day. Yeah. yeah. Um, Clarence has a good, a good dupe for it as well. Nice. Um, what is your favorite memory of your time on the show? My favorite memory is uh, would be the dinner with Joey. It was one just like an incredibly beautiful setting, and yeah. then it was some like it. It was something 
I didn't even know was possible to have in a relationship. Like his reaction really changed how I view dating and myself. That's amazing. And yeah. then to end it off, can you give us a teaser for what's to come this season? I think what's to come this season. I think, you know, obviously it's a very romantic season. I think Joey has an incredible cast of women. So there's going to be stronger relationships starting to form. And I think with that comes heightened emotions. Um, obviously some drama, you know, that's continuing from previous episodes, but I really think the rest of the season is just going to focus on the love stories and uh, yeah, just hopeful that Joey, he's very deserving to find his person and hopefully everyone, hopefully everyone gets to watch that come to life. Nice. Amazing.